It's the opportunity to be able to make a difference every day. It's a team of professionals that are only focused on selfless service. Our service members are willing to put their life on the line for our freedoms because they believe at the point of injury, the best medical care is going to be there in the time of need. When we look at what our young medics are doing and our service members are doing in deployed lands and realizing that they're able to do what they do because they know the best health care is going to be there and that our Army medics and our clinicians are there to put themselves in harm's way so that they can protect our service members and our values. Army medicine is all about people. We have such wonderful staff members and we have to be able to rely on each other. We really want our beneficiaries and everyone who comes across the Army Medicine Department to have trust and faith in us. We want to make sure there is no doubt that you weren't taken care of by the most world-class best facilities and the world-class best people. I'm motivated because I know the dedicated professionals that are part of Army Medicine that come to work every day only wanting to do what's best for our service members and their families. Serving to heal means that through every phase of a healing journey, Army Medicine is there shoulder to shoulder helping them and their family members. We don't ever get to pick when our health breaks down. We never get to pick when the next disease hits us or we get to pick when that injury occurs. It just happens. You know, medicine doesn't heal everything. But if we can give that caring touch to the patient, that definitely would make the process better. To mentally, physically, and medically take care of people and their families, it's what we do. We serve to heal those inside and out. And service comes in many, many ways. You know, you give someone a smile and say hello, it really can perk them up. You just don't know how many ways that you're able to heal somebody. For me, healing means overcoming. It is my job, it's my personal goal in life to serve others. Since both wars kicked off, we've had a lot of significant injuries. Patients coming back 18, 20 years old with significant wounds, burns, missing limbs, and uh, to provide those patients care is um, probably the, the most rewarding for me. I think when we're working with people who serve our country, we have to be especially grateful that we have the opportunity to help them be more successful. You don't realize it until you're in a situation as we're in, but there's people here who really care. My son's a triple amputee. I mean, it was probably the most devastating day of my life, the day I walked into his hospital room. But there's many people here to support you. The doctors here really do care about what you have to say, how you feel. They really do a lot to make you feel comfortable. And they take the time out to make you feel good about yourself again. And I think that's important because serving to heal, it's not just healing the physical, but healing the spirit and the emotions as well. Trust really is the bedrock and the framework of everything that we do. Our service members and their families need to trust us that we have the best intention to help them get to the best level of health possible. We have to be accountable to our patients and accountable to our team members so that we ensure that what we're doing is focused on improving the health of those that we're honored to serve. I think all you have to do is look at the flag and realize that there have been so many sacrifices that are made since the birth of our nation. Army medicine is really the face behind the scenes. It's the glue that binds the Army together. Uh, Army medicine will often work unaccredited and unaccounted for, but you know, without us, the force wouldn't be sustained. To have the honor to serve is really a, a humbling position, a humbling job to have. I think you have to give back what this country has given you. 
And so it's an honor to serve with people. It's an honor to serve for people. It's taking pride in knowing that you are putting someone above yourself. And it's valuing the opportunity to give back to those people who provide us the opportunity to be free. I know that these young men and women have given more than I could ever imagine. And in some small way, I can give back and say thank you. And that's an honor to me. Serving to heal and honor to serve. I really think speaks to the heart of our legacy of Army medicine. We've been honored to serve shoulder to shoulder with our war fighters. There's never been a conflict when we haven't been there with them on point to ensure that they have the best health care process. And that's allowed us to be able to have a strong America and a strong Army medicine team serving with our Army.